Well, I have a little history for you that uh, I hope you enjoy as much as I did. Uh, I happen to be fortunate enough to be going to UC San Diego uh, in the 80s as a graduate student in cognitive science. Uh, actually, it, hadn't, it was being born at the time, so I'm one of the, the first people who, um, as a graduate student, went through a program that was in the early stages of that. Well, doing that program, I was very fortunate because I was in a laboratory that had international collaboration. But what we had to do was bring these people to us, or we had to go to them. It was fortunate because we got to go to Japan, we got to go to the Soviet Union, we, got, we went to a, a, a lot of wonderful places, but we also had a chance for them to come over to us. Now, we had our own in-house ARPANET slash internet, and if there were some colleagues around the country whose university happened to have something even close to the supercomputer that we had, we can enjoy an exchange, collegial exchange with them as well. But one of the really big breakthroughs in the 1980s was doing the reconstruction of the Soviet Union when Gorbachev and colleagues decided to break down the borders. One of the biggest borders that he broke down was through the ARPANET slash internet exchange. And I happen to be present, and I still get goosebumps today, when we were sitting there very excited, waiting for our Soviet colleagues to come online. And it, looked, it, it felt like it was going to take forever. But it certainly happened, and as you know, the rest is history. Thank you. Thank you.